Teresa with Linamoth Creations and I am back. We're going to do a very small crystal unboxing. I had told you all that I was going to stop buying crystals for a minute because I'm going on vacation and then I bought some more. <laughs> and this is also going to be just a little chitty chat letting you know what's going on in my life and where like what the direction of this channel like where I want to go with it you know rearrange here and get comfy so um hello and welcome if you guys are new to my channel my name is Lisa and on my channel I like to do lots of witchy things including crystal unboxings as well as other kind of witchy unboxings uh tarot talk um, all kinds of witchy musings, and, and we're going to talk about that more in just a little bit. Let's open these crystals super quick. So, of course, these are from Bliss Crystals. These are for my personal collection. Um, and most of these are like small tumbled ones, but they were ones that I didn't have, or they just looked very special, and, um, and I just wanted to get them. <laughs> I'm sure that you guys can relate that you just want all the things. <laughs> I want all the things. There is one big crystal in here and I forget. I know it's a cool shape, but I can't honestly remember what type of crystal it is. Um, so <laughs> we'll find that out together. I always buy shit and then I forget what it is by the time it gets here. Alright, so again, this is a small package and then I have one big package that I think has my, um, my larger crystal. So they, um, they give you a how to use crystal companions little card in their uh, boxes that's been coming lately. It, they didn't used to have that in there. Um, and I get these from their live sales. I will link their website below. Um, they have an app and that's how I attend their live shows is from their Bliss Crystals app. Um, and sometimes guys, like I really want to start doing live sales for the crystals that I sell. Um, I am hopeful that I can buy some really great things when I go on my vacation to add my store. It seems so far, my phone's doing things. It seems so far that the tumbled crystals sell a lot better in my store. And I don't know if I just need to do live sales for like the bigger ones. Um, so you guys can really see them and, and know that what you're purchasing, you know, when you're paying more money that you're getting something really awesome. Um, because it's kind of hard sometimes in photos. Okay, I literally have four four small crystals in here. And I think there's... Let me open this box and see. So you're not, we're not opening too much, guys. Because I was really trying to be conservative. It was real hard. It's real hard. I have a hard time. <laughs> oh my gosh, there's a lot of tape on this. Thanks, um, Liz Crystals, for keeping my crystals safe. Yeah, I think this is just one, okay, one crystal in here, but it was a, it was a big one. Okay. Oh, wait, what is this? Maybe this is a free gift or something? Oh, it's probably the stand. Let me just make sure, because a lot of times they give you, like, a little free gift. Maybe it's in with the stand, or maybe I didn't get one with this. Okay. Let me move on my trash over here. I was hoping that I would get my witch casket today, but... It did not come in the mail, so I'm a little bummed about that. I'm still waiting on, I think, my witch casket and my Therabox for this month. And then I think I'm good to go. And then I'm going out of town, guys, so I may... Yeah. Okay, so I'm going to open this little baby free gift. Oh, it's so pretty! Oh, and it's one of my favorite crystals! So they gave me a little free gift. And what I love is they do, like put little stickers on here so you know what you're getting. I also do that in my store. I put like a information card with each crystal. So if you get um, like amethyst, I'm gonna put you an information card of amethyst in there. So they gave me some cute little baby chrysocolla. I love me some chrysocolla. Um, I think most of my chrysocolla is downstairs in my living room. There's another little baby. This is a great one. So they're like kind of blues and greens mixed with um, like brown. I'm not sure what the brown is. We'll put this guy over here. Okay. Let's jump into my little babies. So I have a large, large muggle stone. I don't know. I can't remember. Oh, was it? You know what I think it is? I think it was hematite mixed with um, uh, tiger's eye, and this one's more red. 
Tiger's Eye, I asked them to give me the more red one. I could be lying to you about it, but I'm pretty sure that's what it is. The It's definitely hematite with um, some something, but I'm almost positive this is hematite mixed with Tiger's Eye. So that is Muggle Stone. I don't know that that's the um, technical name <laughs> for it, but that's what they called it. All right, and then I got, it was so pretty, I got a Mookite Jasper uh, Worry Stone or Thumb Stone, however you want to say it. It's one of those little, member guys, I, uh, it's got a good thumb rub. So how pretty are the colors? I I do sell Chrysocola and I do sell Mookite in Tumbles in my store. I don't know that I have them in anything else. And then I do not have this crystal. It, this, it says Cosmic Ocean Jasper Petal. Woo, girl! Look at how pretty. Oh, if it'll focus. There we go. Look. It's so pretty. Yay! Okay. Yeah, I think this is just a stand. We're going to open this just in case there's a free gift in here. Um, but it's from just the stand. Yes, pretty sure. Oh, no, my free gift is in. Oh, it's, it is my free gift. I guess maybe I didn't get a stand for this. My free gift is a quartz sphere. It's a baby quartz sphere. Look at the baby. Oh, it's such a cute little baby. Oh, it's so small. Can you guys... um? Can I see somebody's future in here? I don't know. <laughs> it's, it's very small. It's so cute. Oh my God, I love this. Um, you know what? I think I have another order coming. Shit, I shouldn't have opened this yet until I got my other order because I just remembered something else that I bought. Oh well. We're gonna have another small unboxing for you guys coming up soon. Because <laughs> I do remember that uh, I did order some baby spheres of a certain crystal. Okay, so this one's my Big Mama Jamma. It is a moss agate, and it's in the shape of a, it's a polygon shape. Oh my God, you guys. Look at this MFR. Oh my God, okay. I'm gonna try to show you guys all the Look at this! Oh my god, I was so excited because, so, somebody else had claimed this in the live sale. And I was like, ooh, I wanted that. And they always say, you know, get on the wait list, and ooh, I don't know if you guys can see, there's little Druzy's spots in there. Woo, little baby crystals. Um... They always say get on the wait list because a lot of times people will abandon their carts. So their carts expire through Bliss Crystals after four hours. So um, I was like, you know what? I'm going to get on the wait list. Maybe that person will decide not to get it. They decided not to get it and mama got it. Yay! Oh my God, it's so pretty. I'll put you right there for now. Okay, so that is it for my crystals. So I just wanted to kind of do a little chit chat. Um, with the direction of my channel. So today I'm gonna to be putting up a tarot tutorial. I'm gonna start doing like small bite-sized um, tarot tutorials for you guys, starting from scratch. So if you know nothing about tarot, um, this will be for you. And um, hopefully it's helpful. There's so many great tarot readers, tarot teachers out there. I, you know, Sorry, I've been drinking my monster and I've got the burps. Uh, um, I know I'm not like a number one. I'm not a guru on tarot. Um, I, I've, I'm certified through um, Biddy Tarot. That was my first certification. Freaking love her. I'm also certified through Ethany, um, who are two big tarot names in, in this world. And um, I've got a bazillion decks. I've actually downsized my decks. I did get rid of a bunch of decks. Um, just because I wasn't really using them. But anyways, I digress. Um, so I kind of was like, uh, should I do tarot tutorials for you guys? And then I'm like, you know what? I love tarot. And 
I love talking about it. And so why not put it on here? Even if I'm not the, you know, all knowledgeable tarot person, um, I can learn myself along the way as well as hopefully teach you guys something. And I feel that learning from multiple people, you might learn a little nugget from this person that you didn't get from this person. So I thought, you know what, I'm going to go for it. So hopefully you guys like that. Um, I am also, so I haven't decided if I'm going to call those Tarot Tuesdays or if it's just going to be Learn Tarot with Luna or something like that. We was just going to put it out there because I don't know if I could adhere to like a a every Tuesday type thing, but I would like to do something every week at least, but it may not be on Tuesday, but we're going to see what happens. And then um, I'm also wanting to put out some more types of tutorial and, and learning um, uh, videos for you guys. So that is another goal of mine. Um, and guys, <laughs> I just looked on YouTube and I have surpassed 800 subscribers. Thank you guys. Thank you for, for sticking with me and um, for all you newbies that have been coming on lately. I really appreciate it. And you know, I said my next goal is a thousand subscribers. And um, so I'm really close. Like I'm less than 200 people away from, uh, subscribers away from getting to a thousand. I'm gonna do a really big giveaway. You're gonna get things that you may have seen in my unboxings, maybe things from my store. Um, I love to do big giveaways. And um, when I reach, so to become monetized on YouTube, and yes, that is one of my goals. I don't know if it's rude to talk about that or if it's off-putting, I hope not. Um, but you know, I think that it, having a YouTube channel, it's work. Um, you know, you, you've got to take time away. You've got to buy equipment, like I've got lights and stuff that I've bought. I bought a, a good camera, even though I think I really need to buy a better camera or a better lens is what my goal is. Um, and, you know, editing software and, um, you know, the research on certain things. And, and just like I said, your time, it's, it's a lot. So I think that YouTubers should get paid for the work that they do. And I think it's okay to talk about that. So that's why I'm going to talk about it here. Um, so my goal is to get monetized, you know. And I feel like when I get monetized that... I can start providing better and better content for you guys. Eventually, like this is like one of my ultimate goals. My, my ultimate, my ultimate, ultimate goal, y'all, is to leave nursing. So if you guys don't know, I am a, um, I'm a registered nurse. I am fortunate enough that, I, um, that I'm a virtual nurse. I work from home since the pandemic and it's pretty much for sure that we're gonna stay home. Um, but I'm gonna be moving um, to another state, hopefully. I'm wanting to move to the East Coast um, or somewhere warm because Winter and me just don't like each other. But um, I don't know if my job's gonna let me stay. And um, just nursing for me has kind of gone downhill and the passion is just not there like it used to be, you know? And um, running my Etsy store, hopefully getting into my own um, uh, platform on the internet as well, um, having like my own website and running my YouTube channel and also my um, The Soak Stop, which is my other Etsy store. Um, currently, I do bath bombs. I'm going to expand, but I would really love to be able to afford to just do those things because um, number one, it's my passion. And number two, if all I had to do was focus on that, I feel that I could bring you guys better content and um, just more focus, you know, in, in what I'm bringing you. I also want to hire an assistant. I need, I need like a, a young, hip, social media expert person so I can start doing TikTok and stuff like that. Because, like, listen, I'm 46 and, you know, I can teach myself some things, but I'm just like, oh, my God, how many new things do I have to learn? <laughs> so, anyways, so I looked on YouTube. Okay, you guys know I'm ADHD. I looked on YouTube earlier today. And there are two, two main things that you have to hit on YouTube to get monetized. And I've, I've actually hit one of them. So you have to get a thousand subscribers. I'm at 802 or something like that. And at least 4,000 watch hours in a rolling 12 month period. I believe that's, that's the period. Um, I am over 4,000 watch hours. Yay! So thank you guys so much for watching me. That really, 
really helps me out. And like I said, I've surpassed that goal. So you guys are really helping me on my journey to fulfill my goals and my passions. So I just want to give you such a big thank you. And that's why I do such big giveaways because I really, really am appreciative and I, I do have a very giving heart when it's people that I love and I care about. And of course, you guys fall into that category of people that I love and I care about. Um, I just I love to give. So anyways, um, <laughs> so I just really honestly wanted to thank you guys for helping me you know, start to reach those goals. And I'm really close to reaching that that ultimate, like my, my top goal that I've placed for myself so far. And, you know, I've had people say, you know, isn't it going to be a waste of time starting a YouTube channel? Are you really going to get anywhere? And I feel like I have. So, um, so thank you guys so much for that. And if you know anybody that's interested in this type of thing, witchcraft, um, Wicca, um, crystals, herbs, tarot, all that stuff, let them know that I am out here and I want to be as real as possible for you guys. What you guys get from me is me. You can ask people that know me, like, this is me, girl. <laughs> and I, I don't want to put it on a persona that's just not me. I just don't have time for it. I can't do it. So you guys are getting the real deal, okay? So anyways, I'm going to stop rambling and pretty soon I'm going to do a video on, um, my journey to witchcraft. It's nothing like super profound necessarily, but there are some weird little things in there that have happened. Um, so I'd love to share that with you because people have asked me like, how long have I been practicing and, and that kind of thing. So that video is going to be coming up. So anyways, guys, I'm going to stop rambling. And if you wouldn't mind giving me a thumbs up and leaving me a comment, what you think, if there are things that you would like to see on my channel, let me know. Are you interested in the um, tarot tutorials? I think I'm going to start doing um, some better crystal tutorials. Um, my tarot tutorials are going to incorporate PowerPoint because I really wanted some visual things for you guys and I'm not really, um, I don't really know how to edit and throw things into, this is why I need an assistant. I need a social media YouTube guru person <laughs> that can help me do better videos for you guys. Eventually, I'm going to hire somebody. This is, this is a goal. Goal. So yeah, anyways, I'd love for you guys to leave me a comment what you think of all that um, and what you'd like to see from me. So I've got lots of things in my brain. I just need the time and the focus. <laughs> so if you guys are not a current subscriber, I would love if you would hit that subscribe button and that notification bell so you don't miss any of my videos. And if you're already a subscriber, guys, I've already told you how much I love you and I appreciate y'all. And until next time, guys, have a great day. Bye. Thank you.